Taylor's of Berry is a very simple, small, luxury guest house that we've created here at our home on the New South Wales south coast. It's a simple structure that is all about the view and the location. The colour palette for the guest bedroom, as for the entire accommodation, is based on this. It's, it's based on the nature that surrounds us. We wanted to use shades of green and then we wanted to use shades that pick up on the sandstone the bark of the trees, the natural timber of the deck, and also the black of the structure itself. So everything revolves around that palette. So I decided to obviously paint the walls green. Additional layers of interest and decoration come from the artworks that we've selected. Also, of course, from that beautiful floor tile, the brick floor tile that we've used throughout, and details like the wall sconces. The artwork is particularly important to both David and me. We've chosen one of our favourite paintings. It's an artwork by Lucy Vader and of course the colour palette just works so beautifully with the room. I also have a photograph that was gifted to me by the photographer. I love driving a Mini, I love dogs, so there's a Mini and a dog. What could be better in the black and white photograph? And then of course we've used those classic wall sconces that we've used throughout to bring a touch of, I think, luxury, a touch of real elegance, old-fashioned elegance to the room, finished off with those linen curtains. The bed we selected for the room is King's Encore. We selected queen size because that works best with the proportions of the room. And unusually, we selected the Eden check for the bed head because we thought that gave a beautiful layered and decorative touch to the room. It works perfectly. And I love the fact that Eden, of course, is not too far from here on the south coast as well. So it all seems to be perfect. guest accommodation, you want that wow factor. You want your guests to open those double doors, pull back the linen curtain and go, wow. So yes, we've used a lot of cushions. And people say to me, how many cushions is the right amount? Well, there's, there's no rule. If it takes a lot of effort to get the cushions off and you've got nowhere to store them, that's probably too many. Functionality is, is absolutely paramount but at the same time, it's important to preserve that aesthetic. So you're always looking for that sweet spot between the two things. The unusual choice, I guess, in our guest bedroom is the traditional Indian Almira, which we're using as a wardrobe. I mean, we know that our guests will never be wanting to put too many clothes in there. So the space that that beautiful old vintage piece of furniture gives us is probably fine. And so for us, that did have the perfect balance between aesthetic it goes perfectly with the room and functionality. Look, I, I think the way the room comes together so well is, is actually my favourite element. It's a small room. The pieces have been very carefully chosen, as has the palette. And I think the way it all comes together is, if I can say it myself, quite exquisite. That's my favourite element of the room.